In our rapid assessment, we follow our proven procedures, A for the airway. My name is Martina Ostramarko. I have been working at the Nursing Training College in Kempton for two years, and I am the director of project courses for our skills lab. Ms. Krotenkopf, did you ring? It's difficult to breathe. I'm not getting any air in or out. The main advantage of simulation with nursing Anne is that she reacts to student interaction. She can answer. The student and the mannequin have a conversation, so the student gets into the nursing care process faster and can engage with the actual situation. What would be important to find out? Is anything still missing? Yes, temperature. Very good. What might you be testing for by finding this out? Exactly. We can also practice invasive measures using simulation, for instance, inserting a bladder catheter, which would not be possible with a real person on account of the pain or the risk of infection and so on. My name is Olga Ziegler. I'm a nursing student at the training college in Kempton, and I'm in my second year. Many nursing activities are so complicated that they have to be practiced and repeated a lot. The whole thing is realistic, because everything happens like in real nursing. For me, it is particularly important that I can repeat my training as often as I need to, and that I make mistakes here, during simulation, and not later on a patient. Does that hurt? Simulations are great. This is because we can talk to the patient, so he can react to me in my nursing care. At the end, we then watch a video with the teacher which was recorded during the simulation. That way we can discuss afterwards with the teacher what went well or what could still be improved so that mistakes will be avoided in practice. We are having a follow-up discussion. It is important to reflect on handling the entire situation. My name is Angelica Kirsten. I am the vicarious headmistress and nurse teacher. Here at the nursing school in Kempton, we are able to provide skills training and simulation using a nursing Anne from Lairdal. It is particularly important for us to be able to make mistakes, that students discuss mistakes during their training, are aware of them, learn from mistakes, and also deal with them openly. That way, they will note immediately in practice whether they are carrying out nursing procedures correctly or incorrectly.